Coming into this game, LSU was an 11 and a half point underdog and were highly doubted to beat the Florida Gators. The Tigers dominated on both sides of the ball and never gave up, silencing their doubters. Despite the Tigers' previous loss against Kentucky, Coach O and his team brought a different attitude tonight that resulted in a huge win against the Gators. The offense started strong moving the chains, but it wasn't enough to score on the first drive. The Tigers get things rolling in the second quarter as Max Johnson finds Brian Thomas Jr. for a 71-yard touchdown, then finds Jeray Jenkins for the go-ahead score shortly after. The Tigers were dominant on the defensive side as they kept their momentum and continued to execute all over the field. The defense had three interceptions, one of them resulting in a pick six. Linebacker Damone Clark is complimentary of his teammates on both sides of the ball. I mean, one thing the coaches always harp on is next man up. So, I mean... You know, we, we was going to have to play the game regardless. You know, we, we wish we had our guys, you know, that's that's out for the season. But, I mean, like I said, it's next man up. You know, that's you know that's why there's no ones and twos, you know. But, I mean, I'm just – I'm proud of the guys that stepped up today. Johnson finished the game with 133 passing yards and three touchdowns as the run game was the backbone of the offense against Florida. I think that's just kind of our motto now is just fight, um, fight, fight, fight. And I think that's what our guys have done this week. And, you know, they've, we've, we've kept silent and uh, we've kept our head down and sh just worked, every, you know, throughout the week and uh, it showed this Saturday. The Tigers look to keep up this momentum as next weekend they travel to Oxford to take on Ole Miss. For Tiger TV Sports, I'm Lexi Pagese.